Get out of the city and into an adventure that moves the whole family. Prepare to be moved. The all-new Nissan X-Trail. On air, online, and on your smart speaker. Bettyglue.com.au. Shop anywhere, anytime. SAFM News Briefing. Hi, it's Dan Flake here with the latest. There's even more writing on the Matildas making the Women's World Cup final. Now the PM's talking to public holiday. Anthony Albanese's again vowed to bring up the idea at next week's National Cabinet meeting. The New South Wales Premier appears open to the idea. However, Victorian Premier Dan Andrews isn't committing to anything just yet. He is elated women's sports getting the spotlight and recognition it deserves. You know, I'm really proud to think that we've come so, so far when it comes to women's sport. Women and girls are now getting the, the absolute focus, the accolades, the attention and over time the resources that they are entitled to. More than 6.5 million tuned in to catch at least part of the Aussies winning match on free-to-air telly, topping the ratings for 2023. The national side next faces either France or Morocco in Brisbane this Saturday. A warning this next story is confronting. Federal police have charged 19 men over an alleged sophisticated online child abuse network. The joint operation involving the AFP and FBI also removed 13 children from harm. Aussies are a bit wobbly when it comes to their future finances. The latest on consumer sentiment from Westpac and the Melbourne Institute shows there's been another 0.4 of a percent dip. It's described as deeply pessimistic territory. More than a billion phone scams have been blocked by service providers over the past year. That includes 85 million texts over just three months. And billionaire Elon Musk has revealed he may need to get surgery, which could delay that supposed cage match with Meta head on show Mark Zuckerberg. The tech moguls have been talking up plans for a fight, but dates are yet to be set in stone. After this, there is no turning back. You sip the red can, the story ends. You sip the black can, you enter dreamland. And I show you just how good the truth can taste. Max Taste Challenge. There's been three big retirements today. North Melbourne champ Ben Cunnington will play his farewell game this Saturday against Essendon. Eagles skipper Luke Shuey and Bombers Rockman Andrew Phillips have also hung up the boots today, but we'll call it quits at season's end. Meantime, Essendon vice-captain Andy McGrath reckons they can win all their remaining regular season games to give themselves a shot at making the finals. Each week for us is, is a must-win game at the moment. That's how we're viewing it. Um, so we're, we're putting all our eggs in that basket, giving ourselves the best chance to, to be in the hunt. Buying or selling rural or residential properties, Miller, Juan and John. This is SAFM Weather. 15 and mostly sunny for the rest of the day across the limestone coast. Showers on the way for tomorrow. We're heading for a top of 17. Find the perfect music station to suit all your moods on Listener. Download the Listener app now and search Mood.